Happy holidays, cool cats and kittens. It is Uncle Mad here, December 20th, 2020. Lots of 20s going on today. Oh, there's a police officer. Probably coming to arrest me for doing a vlog in my mobile studio. Nope, you went the other way. Good. Okay, so today we are on our way first to my parents' house. I'm meeting up with my father, aka Waxo, aka Gerald. And we're gonna go to the Titans game. Last regular season home game of the season today, the Titans take on the Detroit Lions. Lions are unraveling. Quarterback Matthew Stafford potentially out today. Hasn't practiced all week with rib injury, I believe. Must win game for the Titans. Colts are nipping in our heels for the AFC, AFC South divisional title. Also, a lot of teams in the mix for the wild card spot, so we don't want to slip down into that realm. When you play the bad teams, you got to beat them. Can't afford to let a game like today slip. Big game for the Titans. Me and Waxo are going. You get to go too because you're coming along with me for the journey. I think that's all I want to say in the intro. Did I leave anything out? What do you think? Think your thoughts. All right, we're here. Peace on Stadium. Time to tighten up. Jackson of the Young Bucks working security. Oh my God, he's out here killing people again! <laughs> All right, it's 21 nothing or 21-7 Titans off to a good start. I'm making my annual pilgrimage to the pro shop where I look around and buy nothing. So it's become a tradition at this point. So I got to keep it up. I'm a big fan of these pullovers but I can't quite pull the trigger. It's a little bit too expensive for me. It's not bad, I kinda like this. It's really cool to get like an old school 
Titan starter jacket. This is kind of similar. Oh, I'm just a sucker. Hmm, not today. Tradition continues, bought nothing. Alright, so Puckets needs a better system. It took me like two minutes to get my nachos. I'm pretty sure some other guy took mine because they just take your name and then they just give it to whoever. I don't know what the deal is. Should take 10 minutes to get nachos. They need to get their system worked out because that was terrible. Alright, so here we go. These are the nachos from Puckets. Not bad, look alright. Pour cheese all over the top of the sauces. I don't even really see a chip in here anywhere, so I don't even know how to eat this. Bone apple teas. Pretty good, probably not worth the time or effort I had to go through to get it though. Okay, so after finishing up, the nachos were good. Bucket's probably the best food option here at the stadium, but the ordering system definitely needs some work. 15 Titans at the half. We're getting a concert from Runaway June, which appears to be one solo artist with two random girls standing beside her. I don't know. They're okay. 24-18 Titans started the fourth quarter. Driving down the field, trying to get a score to try to close this game, put some space between us and the Lions. The inside of my mask smells like nacho cheese. We will officially not be 9-7 this season. The best news of the game. Okay, so to encourage social di distancing, the Titans have asked that anybody that will stay in the stadium for an extra 15 minutes will get a special promotion. Don't know what it is, but we're hanging out to see what it is. It's probably going to be something stupid, but we're going to find out. With code Titans 30. Code is valid through tomorrow, December 21st. A reminder that this offer is for online shopping only. Okay, so that is another Titans game in the book. The final regular season game at home this season, so possibly the final game day vlog of the season, although definitely want to try to do something for the playoffs. If we have a home playoff game, I'd like to go. Don't have tickets secured yet for that, though. Titans have not yet secured a home playoff game. Still work to be done for them. But we'll see what's coming in the future. Broke the streak of me vlogging at games and the Titans losing today, so that's good news. Still a little worried about the defense. Matthew Stafford had all day to throw the ball. We got one sack, but it was only because they had a bad snap on a shotgun play. It had nothing to do with us actually creating any pressure. I mean, at this point, I think we know there's just nothing that can be done. At this point, you know, if we still aren't getting pass rush, it's just, it is what it is. We've got a Dory Jackson back. Hopefully that helps the secondary. Maybe they can just hold up a little better, even though we can't get any pass rush. It is what it is. Titans win, tighten up. Next week, December 27th, Sunday night football against the Packers. That should be a very, very interesting game going up to frigid Lambeau Field, late December. But we got a guy who can probably uh, do some things up there in the, in the cold. A guy who's probably going to be even less fun to tackle when it's less than like 10 degrees. And that's Mr. Tractor Cito, the King Derrick Henry. Another big day for him today. Good to see. I actually said to uh, my dad during the game, I got to imagine being a Lions fan has to be the worst team. That has to be like the worst team to be a fan of in all of sports because they've just been 
terrible for like forever. They had like one or two mediocre seasons recently, but just been bad forever. And like it's almost worse now because you have Matthew Stafford, who like I think might be one of the best quarterbacks of his generation. You know, Aaron Rodgers, Matt Ryan, that kind of era of quarterbacks. He's probably right there with those two, if not better. And they've still sucked. Like, it's so hard to get a good quarterback in the NFL, and they've had one for, like, 10-plus years, and they've still somehow sucked. It's just going to be miserable to be a Lions fan. Like, Titans have had bad seasons here or there, and it sucks. Those are frustrating. They're never fun. But then we come back, and we have, like, seasons like we've been having recently. But the Lions are just always bad. I can't – ugh, it would suck. If you're a Lions fan, let me know in the comments down below how have you managed to do it. And my hat's off to you for putting up with – that team and sticking with your team that you know shows something but anywho that's it for today make sure you're subscribed to the channel that you have the bell turned on for notifications so that if we are able to go to a playoff game if we do any content at a game or if we just do some kind of home vlog for the playoffs whatever might happen if we make the playoffs i shouldn't be saying this because we haven't technically clinched a playoff spot yet so but you'll get all updates coming about anything that we do related to Titans. We've been doing a lot of Christmas content lately. It's been fun. We'll have a few more of those coming up as we finish up the holiday season. But thanks, as always, for checking out the channel, checking out my videos. Thanks for doing the proper things that we did today inside Nissan Stadium to follow the protocols, to be safe. Of course, what I'm talking about is I'm saying don't stand so close to me. Tighten up.